We've got three amazing people standing before you today. We have obviously the Honourable <laughs> Mr. Robert Catter. I'm often here because uh, this, uh, this work is uh, a tribute to the Bergside Council. Well, I'm at the uh, Buffalo Picnic Pavilion um, and this is something they do annually. It's a, with the Gregory River kayak event, there's a lot of people who come here for that event and as a result they have this race day. Um, they have the kayak event tomorrow and the race day today. Thank you, John, for those first few beers to wet those pallets. Now, you need Free to buy beer. tickets to purchase your Here at the racetrack for the first five minutes, so taking opportunity while I can. Well, parading themselves for the first race which should be starting in about 10 minutes team also going to join in this morning <laughs> I 
Okay, Jeff. Jeff. just completed the course. Um, Ray, um, the thing about the Gregory is that it's it's not just a paddle for 43 kilometres or the marathon and you're trying to do it in under four hours but it's the it's the difficult sections that you the rapid sections that you meet along along the way. Yeah. Did you get hung up on any of those? Um, the rapids were, rapids are okay I find that's easier than wending your way through the pandanus palms. Okay. You, you fight, fight left and right to go around that's pandanus palm. And I got one in my belly and I thought I was going to push through it and it just sprang okay. me back oh. <laughs> and uh, tipped me in. So yeah. you can, you never really can tell, even though you can practice different parts of the river, no. you can never tell what's going to necessarily happen and on the, the day. And by the time you get to the hard part, you're wrecked. And you're tired. And you're tired. And yeah. it makes it ten times harder okay. to dodge things. <laughs> oh, so. well, yeah. Oh. Thanks very much for giving us an account. That's all right. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, this last since Galloping Jacks, I've been trying to chase that other fellow down. Yeah. Oh, it was uh, close. He was opening up the gap, though. It felt like a long three kilometres that last bit. It's eight. Anyway, here. <laughs> oh no, great yeah. effort. Yeah, Is great effort. Nice? Well, Jeff, congratulations again on your second place. Um, there'll probably be quite a few people interested in. Um, this race and this event it's held once a year i understand yeah that's right and you've been doing it for how long um since 1995 and would you recommend it to oh yeah I'd other paddlers it. i would yeah i love it i come back here it's a great place and um really enjoyable lots of nice people and tell me what the course is like uh, you've done how first of all how long is the course uh, it's 43 kilometers long uh it's quite challenging in places and um other places this long tiring water holes but um, yeah enjoy every minute of it and um, I guess you can you can't you can never predict uh, just how the race is going to go because you don't know whether you're going to get hung up on some of these um, some of these places that they call wipeout bend tell me about some of these places um, so yeah there's quite a few um, obstacles that they've named down the river uh, the first one right at the start they call Carnage Leap, for obvious reasons. A lot of boats try and scramble down there together and there's absolute carnage. 
Uh, the next one's Kenny's Corner, which is pretty challenging. And then along the river there's um, Kamaga, which is uh, quite a difficult set of rapids with lots of sharp rocks and things to dodge. Um, then uh, another one, as you said, Wipeout Bend. Uh, further down the river we go through Pandanus Alley. Uh, lots of Pandanus and, and we wind our way through the Pandanus. Um, places you can barely see where to go and then um, we get down to the finish line. Okay. Oh, sorry, one more I missed was um, um, Galloping Jacks, they call it. It's a really fast-flowing set of rapids. No rocks to worry about, but it's quite a rough ride because they, the waves really stand up. And tell me about your particular race. Um, did, you, um, did you have any difficulties in your race? Yeah, I had a few mishaps. Um, the first one was Kenny's Corner, five, 500 metres into the race, I came out of the boat. Um, I'd practised it twice before and had no problems, but I, I fell out there. Um, went down Camarga okay, um, and then down in the Pandanus, I, I hit a stick at one place and it rolled me over, and then another one, I got trapped behind another boat and uh, I got washed into the Pandanus and rolled over. Uh, but yeah, enjoyed every minute of it, and uh, it was a great day. And you're a very experienced paddler, so that's. Uh, but but generally speaking, you don't have to be a very experienced paddler to um, to do the course and just simply enjoy it. Yeah, that's right. And and um, yeah, you have to choose the boat carefully because um, some are easier to handle in the water than others, and. Um, you can also do the short course, which is 17 kilometres, and a lot of people choose to do that early on in their experience. Okay, and uh, what I've also found here is that um, there is, seems to be a very social group here. Everybody's starting to get to know each other, and um, what, you're camping here by, by the river, by the, and um, each evening you're meeting up with everybody. Yeah, that's right. We're, there's a bunch of us. Um, of camp around the, the area here and particularly regular visitors that um, all get together and uh, but anybody's welcome and then one night the uh, Northwest Canoe Club puts on a, a dinner and uh, last Friday night they fed about a hundred people on, um, on um, they had they cooked a whole pig in the camp oven and uh, vegetables and chickens and um, lamb. Fantastic. Uh, so it's put on by the Northwest Canoe Club, which is from based in Mandiza. Yeah, that's right. Right, wonderful. Jeff, thank you very much for taking the time to uh, give us this short interview. Thank you. And congratulations again on your second place. Thank you. Here are the paddlers at the pub. After the race has finished. <laughs>